Welcome to the Canada Science and Technology Museum. Today we'll be talking about the electronic sackbud, one of the first known synthesizers and a trailblazer in the world of electronic music. Hugh Lacan was the Canadian innovator behind this instrument. He began his career as a physicist developing radar systems at the National Research Council of Canada. Although a physicist by trade, his true passion was for electronic musical instrument design. From his home workshop between 1945 and 1948, Lacan developed a groundbreaking instrument that he called the electronic sackbud. He named it after the sackbut or sackbud, an archaic 15th century precursor to the modern trombone. Lacan had no way of knowing it, but what he was actually building was one of the world's first analog synthesizers, two decades before the first commercial synthesizer was sold. Looking at the artifact, you can see how experimental it really was. But don't let its rough appearance deceive you. The electronic sackbut was a powerful electronic instrument with many of the same features and sounds we associate with modern synthesizers today. In 1954, the National Research Council of Canada saw such potential in Lacan's design that they made him head of their new electronic music lab, the first in Canada. His job? To work full-time developing new and unconventional electronic instruments for other researchers and artists to explore. Over the course of his career, Lacan designed over 20 unique instruments and is considered one of the most important pioneers of electronic music in Canada. You can come and see the electronic sackbud and some of Lacan's other electronic instruments on display in the Sound by Design exhibition at the Canada Science and Technology Museum. <laughs>